So, this is the time of the day when we attempt to make some sense of what we've been doing. And we've invited three people for that very hard task to both kind of capture what's emerging. And, and in a sense, it might feel a bit like a closing, but in the same way, a few new provocations that might invite us to go deeper into some conversations that are very specific to us. And then this will be followed by Do not fuck with me. <laughs> right, so back to... <laughs> um, so yeah, so in a moment, we will be inviting uh, three people whose work we admire. Some we know very well, some we know very little, met very recently. And we've either worked together or have heard of their work. And, and we, we really think that they will offer uh, very interesting insights. There's one thing I wanted to mention just before we go into that. Um, just before I do, how many people, uh, who hasn't been to the container prototype? One person here, one person there. Cool, and that, oh, another person, and another person, this is four. And I think there's two there at the moment. The reason why I wanted to wait until most of you had seen it is just to reiterate an element of our lab, which I think is very pertinent uh, to the discussions we've been having. And that's about methodologies of work and exchange and collaboration and articulating what's important about one's work and also the role of audience in the making and the playing. And the audience for that prototype was TAG. That prototype was not made for you and that prototype was not made for an audience. And I think it's very important to say that now that you've experienced it. TAG were coming over from Montreal. We have never worked together meaningfully before. So we said, what's the minimum prototype? What are the things we're gonna ignore? Even things that are important to us, we're gonna ignore and not work on. Things that we really wanna work on that will articulate where we're at before we even try and explain it. So basically, what do we want to put them through so that we have the same point of reference to then have the conversations and start the jamming? So that prototype was made for a very specific purpose and we're very happy to talk about the decisions we made about it uh, and some th certain things that contradict our previous work. And in, in many ways, we would never present that as a game, for instance, um, but certainly offer it to be hacked by game designers. Um, so anyway, I just wanted to kind of contextualize that because that emerged out of one of the conversations today. So thank you, Luis, for that. And, and the, as we go into deeper conversations about lab models and choices you make and how you collaborate, how you articulate your work, what you're looking for and purpose, I thought that might be a good kind of segue into that conversation. So 